Zoo Montana is getting an earful tonight about an event coming up later this month. The zoo is holding a drag queen story hour as part of Pride Month celebrations. Our Haley Monaco has more on the controversy. June is Pride Month and with festivities kicking off soon, the Billing Zoo is receiving some backlash for an event being held there. Some even vowing to never attend the zoo again. But 406 Pride and the zoo are not backing down. Zoo Montana is the place to go to see something new and perhaps unexpected and that extends beyond the animals. Later this month, the zoo will hold a drag queen story hour, an event most Montanans have never experienced and one some say they will never attend. Why are we putting such a contentious issue right in the heart of an area? Jenna McKinney oversees the group Montana Family Rights Alliance. She and others are calling and emailing the zoo, asking the zoo to reconsider. This is not appropriate. We really don't appreciate this in our community, and especially at this venue. But Zoo Montana is standing by its decision. In a Facebook post, director Jeff Ewalt wrote, while personal threats and threats of no longer supporting the zoo are concerning, we will not let unwarranted fear and hate deter our decision to move forward with this harmless and fun reading event that is held throughout the country. At the end of the day, if your personal agenda does not fit this event, we simply ask you do not come to the zoo that day. Walt Donges is the president at 406 Pride and is proud of the zoo's support. There's a few times uh, in my life that I can say oh, I'm actually impressed, but I am impressed. I am pleased that it's not just me standing up, it's, it's the zoo standing up for what's right. And Donges says 406 Pride is no stranger to this kind of reaction. In this conservative community, people think that their way of thinking is the right way all the time. And, and there's not a lot of room for those of us that think differently or progressively. Yeah, we, we know what we're up against. We're up against a bully. But McKinney and others say they're far from a bully. They see this as a moral issue and think the June 22nd event crosses a line. To put something like this in the heart of a, a place that's for small children is just wrong. In Billings, Haley Monaco, MTN News.